likes to tone him. Big shot. Perfectly executed combination. Oscar De La Hoya's down. He's going to have to beat the count. Somehow, some way, he's gonna continue on here. And if he's gonna stay in this fight, now he's got to avoid this opponent like the Black Plague. Punch and move, punch and move. Good work with the uppercuts. Nice job there. Solid, and he goes down again. Will he get up from this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Dave Ahoy is rising back up. That takes some guts. Counter punch. He took a shot, but he came back with a right hand of his own. Good defense, just covering up down low. Good job on the two punch combo by Tommy Hearns. Damo Hoy is well off the mark that time. Let's go. Let's go. You can do it. You can do it. We can recoup from that knockdown. Let's do it. Tommy Hearns' backers know that he's in control of this fight. Everybody in the arena can see it. Your scorecard has him way up as we begin round number 11. Plus, he really hasn't been damaged at all. He's Oscar De La Hoya. There it is. Well, he's been there before, and now he's there again. He got four. He can't afford to keep going on that floor. You have to wonder when the referee's going to step in now and stop this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Dave Ahoy is now getting back up off the canvas. with an uppercut there after getting hit. Hearns is getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. Now he's back with his man up against the ropes. Hearns has given us a good showcase of defense here tonight, especially up top. His head movement is just sublime. And his opponent's cooperating with him a little bit because he's getting frustrated. He's looking for that big shot, and he's continuing to miss. He's making no adjustments. A guy's moving his head. You know what you want to do a little bit? What's that? Well, you want to feint him a little bit. Make him make a premature move. And then when he moves to either side, then you time him with a punch. And yet another big shot comes in. Oscar De La Hoya's got to beat the count, but I don't think he has it in him. So now the question becomes, after that knockdown, and he has gotten up, how does he survive? So this is where instincts kick in. You got to start moving that head automatically right now. You don't want to stay in the middle. Oh, they both land flush with uppercuts. Keep moving. Keep moving. Stay on the outside. Up, up. Both men digging in with uppercuts. Oh, and they decide to trade there. Big shot there. Can he beat the count? I don't think so here, Teddy. Now I know where they got that saying. Falling like a sack of potatoes. One, two, three, four, five. And it's over. This fight is over. 